welcome back on this Friday morning. We're in for a nice day. We're expecting some sunshine. This is what it is potentially going to look like for parts of Newberry today. Upper 60s as we head towards the afternoon with a wind flow out of the south. Here's what's happening across the region. High pressure just to our southwest. It was a lot of clouds to clear out overnight, but with some moisture and some calm conditions, we've seen fog develop because of that. Now looking ahead, there's a secluded front over into the northern plains and over into Minnesota. It's uh, going to eventually fizzle out and we'll just see a little wave of energy from the remnants of this move through tonight extending into tomorrow. It'll bring in a line of some showers and some thunder showers. So right now looking good out there aside from the fog in the central areas. Rainfall tomorrow will have uh, about half of an inch to about an inch of rain within parts of Gogebic and Ontonagon counties. And you can see here that this is not really going to be a huge impact to the central and the eastern areas of the UP tomorrow. Here's the timeline of that. Here's this afternoon, 4.30 in the afternoon, some sunshine and some clouds by that point in time, wind flow out of the south. Then tonight into tomorrow morning, here comes those showers and those thunder showers for those western areas of the UP. Rumbles of thunder likely and a few pockets of more moderate to heavy rain uh, will be possible in parts of the far west end of the UP. We do need the rain. We're still under drought conditions though. So watch what happens as that rain moves towards the central UP by about midday, it fizzles out. So if you're in the central UP, there are some events going on Marquette County down into Dickinson and Iron County. So it's just a few of these little light scattered passing rain showers. Not a whole impact for the eastern UP. As we look towards Sunday looking good with some sunshine and wind flow out of the south. Also going to be a warmer one. Sunday might be a really great day to check out some fall colors. The western areas of the UP, especially those interior areas away from Lake Superior are reaching near peak for colors within Ontonagon, Gogibic, Iron, Southern Houghton and Barriga counties. Definitely seeing a lot of color in the higher elevations of Western Marquette County, those highland areas, the Michigami Highland areas, uh, definitely seeing more rusty colors there now because those uh, usually turn probably uh, are the first ones to turn in uh, fall season. Temperatures today, upper 60s to low 70s in our interior areas, mid to upper 60s along the shorelines of the Great Lakes tomorrow, some low 70s. Check out Sunday though, low 80s and some of our interior central and Western areas. So going to be a little bit warmer, feeling a little bit more like summertime as this big ridge amplifies right over the Great Lakes. I think the core of the warmest air is going to be concentrated across our area on Monday. Eventually, we'll see a pattern shift by the end of next week, and that'll bring in a line of showers and thunder showers next Thursday. Following that, we'll likely have some cooler air. Today's pets waiting for.